Just like Dominic predicted, Elijah's like, wait, where are we? So the last time we were at Disney, we were actually on our road trip to California from Florida. So that was really fun. It was my first time and their first time at Disney's California Adventure. We are annual pass holders at... Um, Disney. Yes, at our Disney. I don't know what's wrong with me. I've been working all day, so I literally think I'm like, what are words? What are words? I'm an English teacher, so I'm like, da, 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 all day. So anyway, we're taking an after school trip to our favorite place in the entire world. Um, we haven't been to the Walt Disney World Resort since October. I think it was like the day before Halloween. Um, we dressed up really cute. It was so much fun. Um, so I'm really happy to be here again with the boys and let's get into the park. This is the Zoe Double Stroller. Let me know down below if you'd like to see a full review. So we have um, Dominic's Magic Band, and then I have my Apple Watch, and that's usually how we get in, so we really don't even use our, um, like our bands all that much because I use my Apple Watch. So just a tip. You want to go up to him? Was that fun? <laughs> so Elijah refuses to sit in the stroller, which is not the most fun when I'm by myself here today without my husband until I meet up with my sisters. So good times. I'm glad that he's so independent, but seriously, I really want to make it to the wall painting. So the wall painting is right there, but I don't know if we're gonna make it the way the kids are like stopping every two seconds. Oh. Come on, Elijah, let's go. So you have to pick up your paint first and then you go over to the wall across. All right guys, we're gonna go get some paint. You ready? Eight squares, thank you. Hi. How many? Um, so we'll just do uh, for two. Let me give you a nice paint brushes for them. All right. There you go. They'll be painting eight squares each. Thank you. Okay, guys, you ready to paint? Okay, so she gave us really bright colors. <laughs> We're gonna paint the wall, guys. What colors do we have? Yellow. Yeah. Okay, and then what color is this? What's it? Blue. 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 I'm walking like a banana. <laughs> 
flowers and a paint a wall already. The cast member, she did tell us that this will not come out of clothes. So really be careful um, if you do decide to paint this mural, so. is going to be so it's pretty neat that's what the result is going to be and i can kind of see it right there we are here journey into imagination um we're gonna meet up with my sisters after this and uh oh your magic band fell uh -oh. i think this is like my first time being um here like by myself with the boys i've been pregnant with him while being with him at disney before but this is an adventure <laughs> It's a Disney California adventure, but we're at Epcot, so. Oh my goodness, it's Joy. I have never seen her and she's leaving. Of course, the first time I would see her, she's leaving. She does not look very joyous though. Like, she does not look happy. She looks like she's happy to go home. Oh, maybe she's gonna go see a kid. Oh, that's what it is. Okay, I thought she was like, oh, my, my shift is over. <laughs> see you. Hi. of Epcot because they let off so much energy and actually I almost just lost one of my kids. I started filming and he was gone so I probably need to stop filming probably right now because I'm gonna end up losing a kid but this is an awesome place for the kids to let off some energy especially if you come here by yourself with a kid. <laughs> Oh my goodness, this is a great break. And they have a little bench right here for lazy people like me. He's way nicer than Joy. Hi. Hi. So that's behind the scenes? Yeah. This is Van Gogh. 
go try it out. Looks like you're in that painting. What? What in the world? Notice they don't have the big 3D art. Oh my you notice that? Like, you the one that's so I interactive. I that it was maybe on the other side or something. No. So. Not this oh year. my god. We're right here. Yes, we are. Wow. Okay, we're where are we going? Right up, we gotta cross the boat right up there. Okay. And, uh, to go we, where? And then we see the Ecanto ride up on the other side. Okay, there's, it's not going to be a ride though, it's just going to be a booth. We're going to eat there. So this is the line, all because of the Madrigals. Okay, that's yummy, I want to eat it. Okay, we're going to have some. Very convincing. What does it taste like? It's like strawberry. Mm. Okay. What does that part taste like? Try it out. Yes. Oh, it's just a cookie. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so here's the thing. It's not like I want to taste it. great, but it's like One I wasn't expecting that in the middle because usually empanadas that I have are not as like like hearty in the middle. Like it's not as like full. No, honey, that has alcohol in it. <laughs> okay, let's try it. That's the smoothie for kids. Fine. Do you like it? Not it's only nice. good if he says wow or mmm. Nope. Yeah. No, nope, he said he wants snacks from his bag. Okay, so I tried the empanadas from the Canton booth, and I'm gonna give it a seven out of 10. It's very, very hearty, very filling. The potatoes are nice, but that's all you taste, potatoes. Just a little spicy, like a dash. <laughs> For all, yeah, a I'm seven out of 10. I'm thing for 10 out of 10. Why? What do you like about the food? It tastes like um, cocoa melon to me. Cocoa melon? Yeah. What is cocoa melon? Um, it tastes like the, the wow. coconut melon that has water in it. Oh, water oh, melon. Oh, watermelon. <laughs> Dominic, what do you think about the empanada? The lines are hot and you only can taste the, the chicken in there and that. That's but that's a 10 out of 10 though. The smoothie. Yeah. That's gonna be uh, a 
A zero out of ten. <laughs> uh, the guava mousse. It must be guava and strawberry because there's a taste that I really love in there. That probably is the strawberry. The guava is a bit too bitter for me. So if you like sweet and tart, then this is perfect for you. This is the daiquiri. Like an eight out of 10, I guess. Just because it's like not the most innovative drink ever, but it's actually really good for a daiquiri, I would say. Like it actually really is. It tastes better than like a mix that you would do at home for sure. So it, it definitely is at least a step or two above that. <laughs> Japanese buddy yeah. it's Japanese so it's called you ready listen to me listen to mommy it's important this is called yeah. a kimono yeah. can you say yeah can you say kimono? kimono that's right we're about to watch the latest show that Epcot has going on now come on down we gotta go see the fireworks let's go run go 